What's up, nerds, and welcome back to Everything Nerdy. My name's Joe, and this is Top 5 Comics of the Week. Let's go. In at number five, we have Batman 118. Now, the great thing about this comic this week is we've got a new story arc, and it's called The Abyss Part 1, Now It's a Party. So if you're going to pick up on this comic, and if you're going to join in, now is the perfect time as this new story arc begins. In at number four, we have The Amazing Spider-Man 80. B-E-Y. Now, this comic is really cool because we've got Aunt May, we've got Dr. Octopus, and also we've got Peter, well, Spider-Man on the cover, and it's a really nice cover in itself, but also it's pretty cool because obviously, as you know, we've got the new Spider-Man coming out very, very soon, so it's almost like a, a very fitting time for this story in the comic to come through into um, real life, although obviously it's completely different types of stories. However, it's still quite a cool um, little matchup. It's still a really cool cover, and that's why it's at number four. In at number three, we have Suicide Squad number 10, where Robbie Thompson and Dexter Soy bring us the story Spaced. Now, the reason I've picked this one is because of the cover. This week I've tried not to go for the covers too much, but it's just such a cool, colourful, expressive cover that I couldn't not pick it this week. Uh, the cover artists have done a great job on that. The depth in the cover is really cool, and that's why I put it at my number three. In at number two, we have Superman, Son of Kal-El, 2021 Annual, number one. Now, I've chosen this because it's quite a pivotal point in John Kent's um, time as Superman as we see Lex Luthor return to Metropolis. Now it'll be really interesting to see how John Kent navigates this as well as all the cool new things coming into his story anyway. It's going to be really interesting to see how these two work together. So that is why it's at number two. And finally, in at number one, we have Swamp Thing number 10. Now, I have a bit of a private personal reason for picking this, and it's because when I went to a comic convention recently, we had Ram D, the writer, talking to us about some really cool things. And I actually think it's such a, a cool comic for him to be writing for. He's done loads of big things before, but he's also a bit of a kind of a name drop because I got to go see him um, talk about these things live. And I just love the idea of Swamp Thing. I love the story that's going on at the moment. And I know how brilliant Ram B's writing is. And I'm sure that this will be another killer as we go into Conduit Part 2 in that story. So that's why I've chosen it as number one. Now, you're going to have to let me know if you agree with these picks. Do you think there were some better comments this week coming out? Well, if there was... Put it down in the comment section below and we'll have a look at that and see whether we were right or wrong. But if you haven't already, please make sure you subscribe down below. You leave a like because it means so much to us. We're only a small channel. We're looking to go on a journey to grow. So make sure you subscribe down below and we will see you in the next video. Bye.